off the ground as the crowd start to fill in. The Miami Sharks, having been included in the MLR's round eight, 15, Jonas Petrakopoulos drops to the bench with a renewed front row, which includes Prop Evans, Welsh international, and Tevita Sol in an otherwise unchanged pack. In the backs, there's still no Tomás Cubelli, the team captain, as he's still on concussion protocol. Felipe Echeverri is retained at fullback, and Chilean Santiago Virela will play again at number 10. Michael Han, on loan, will try and score again, as he did in his debut game last week. Jose Pelitena, Pelitena the coach. And the Dallas Jackals, who had a week off last week, are fresh, and will aim for the fourth win in the tournament. Keep an eye for Samuel Tuifua, the big New Zealand number eight in a pack with only one change from the previous game against Suta, with captain Jeronimo Gomez Cavada coming back from injury and taking the place of fellow co-captain and lock Sam Gola. In the backs, the much welcome return of fly half Martin Elias, who will enjoy the service of South African Quandi Oliver in the team coach by Argentine Agustin Cavalieri. In Florida, and we see Martin Elias ready for the long kickoff. Dan Pryor takes the ball, goes into contact. Ronan Foley goes to ground. And again, they continue to attack. And it seems like they're going to get to a try. And it is a try. It is. And this is about ensuring to gain meter by meter, not hurrying up. And that's a great attack by Makin Ali Khan. Will he get there? He can't be stopped. And it's a try. Second try for the Dallas Jackers. Right at the right time as they go to a break. It'll give time to the Jackers to reassess what they're doing right. And for the Sharks, they'll probably talk about the defensive lines that are not being as efficient as they have to be. You can see the strength of Ali Khan as he breaks two tackles and touches down for the second try. Elias goes to ground. Oh, great attack from Morcada. He can't be stopped. Is he going to be stopped? Quick ball, and it's a fullback, and it's a fullback. As he scored, he scored. Corner Winchester scores the third try. Identifying that the defense yeah, was, was passive, so he yeah. took the ball flat gaining more meters and at the end I think it was prior he went yeah. off the line trying to tackle uh, his inside uh, with his inside defender to an attacker that created the gap that we could see there from number one Oliver and the ball is ripped off by the Sharks but they lose the ball and it's Tuifua that is going to create the fourth bonus point try and as he touched down he has he has it's there the ball has been recovered no it hasn't very hard to see what's happening Oliver decides which way to go passes but it's going to be another try sixth try Tomás Malanos and since then they kept on the ball playing very direct rugby, being patient. We could see Jerónimo Gómez Vara a couple of times, Juan Pablo Seis taking the ball, being patient. Low ball, the Sharks haven't taken quick ball, which is crucial. The ball is charged down, and it could be a problem oh, for the Sharks. What a pass. And that is a great, great try for Ronnie McElligot. And again, that's it. Elias kicks away, and the Dallas Jackals win 38-17, fourth win for the Jackals.